one of the newly formed political groups of the state, Kakam, had met media persons at a press conference in the city on the 11th of January 2023, where leaders informed about the constitution of the party and response received from the public, especially from constituencies of the East, North and South Shillong. At the same time, an account of expenses incurred as part of the upcoming election campaign of three candidates of the party was also announced. We believe we are people who have come from social movements and people who have been working towards ensuring transparency and accountability, especially in public life. And uh, so we also, from the very beginning, have maintained that we will be keeping in line with our belief in transparency and accountability. So today we also will be uh, sharing with you our disclosure of accounts uh, till date in our campaign. Uh, as you know, uh, you know elections and especially electoral financing, election spending is something which is so secretive, which many of us don't even know even though it's mandatory to file reports to the ECI post an election, but not many parties are up to disclosing the kind of financing that they get from where and how much they spend on what. And uh, especially after the introduction of electoral bonds, we know that it has become that much more opaque. And so we believe for us from the very beginning that if what we are trying to do is to bring in a change in governance and in the electoral process, it has to begin with the campaigning process itself. It is like a letter to the people where we talk about who we are. People have a right to know our background. What is our educational background? What work have we done? And what why are we contesting elections? So that was one of the materials we distributed to each and every household. The second is the come document, which is very elaborate because we feel that there has to be a basis on which we are launching our fight and our struggle to better our state. And the come document highlights in detail what we stand for, almost sector-wise. So, we believe that people also were very happy to receive these documents because many of them have engaged with us on these documents, have questioned us or have disagreed with us. And the other thing which we distributed was this survey form. It's a two-sided survey form, again in different languages. And the purpose of this survey form was again to understand from the people what is it that we need for our state and our constituencies? The survey form tried to capture people's hopes and aspirations. What are the things that have not been done in the constituencies? And it's also trying to capture what is it that people are looking for in a candidate and a legislator. When we produced the anthem of solidarity, our artists in the state said, we want to sing that song for the people. And in addition to all of these talents and skills, people have also donated. And it is heartening because out of the nine lakh plus donations that we have received till date, 47% of the donations, that is four lakh plus, four lakhs 36,000, are donations that have come from the people of Meghalaya. And donations have come in in 100 rupees, 200, 2,000, 5,000, you know, in varying amounts. And out of this, there are also people from the rest of the country who believe that a campaign like ours in Meghalaya is something that they have been waiting for even in the country. Because some of those people have also themselves been part of campaigns across the country where People who were not expected to contest elections through people's support have won elections. So, again, we want to put on record our 
thanks to all of these people who have donated. And out of the 9 lakhs plus that we have raised, the expenditure till date has been almost 3 lakhs for printing, for the solidarity anthem, for conveyance, for running our offices at Hari Sabha and Malki, and also um, towards refreshments sometimes when we're having our pocket meetings and uh, working uh, long hours. So the balance amount with us now is about 6 lakhs. And you have to remember that this 9 lakhs is an amount that has come for the people for three candidates.